see the way you stop and stare at waitresses with pretty hair and swear beneath your breath that you'll return once you're impaired enough to ask them how they got that way achieve that naked style you say you're hooked on but you could write a book on how to look just like a goddess or maybe just the daughter of a god who slept around just like your dad who never settled down was it his influence that caused you to convince yourself that you're not half as brilliant as I think you are? Or maybe it was those guys you met on dating sites who thought that biting statements might convert you to a state of mind where kindness was a novelty, that they were functionally exempt within a society where anxiety seems to become more and more likely each day. Of your lips could launch thousands of ships, so it's so shit you have to use them to cover the bruises you got from the ex that you stayed with for sex until the fact he made you come couldn't make up for what would come next. Or was it Hector, who clearly seemed to expect too much of you? Was it Paris in his blue Toyota Yaris? In that car he went too far, but it was far too late and dark outside for you to find another ride. So fine, just please don't come inside. You went back to your room and cried, confided in your diary. You couldn't find the will to leave. Is that why you can't look at me? Divert your gaze each time I call you pretty. Feel the need to come up with something that sounds witty. Deflect me with a joke or start to smoke the weed. You hope I haven't noticed that you clearly need. But the curve of your lips can launch thousands of ships So it's some shit you have to use them To cover the bruises you got From the ex that you stayed with for sex You keep saying that you're broken But it seems that I've broken my guess but the curve of your lips could launch thousands of ships so it's so shit you have to use them to cover the wounds that you got from the boys who hurt Helen of Troy <laughs> Thank you.